Hey guys, Dashing Subtile here, and welcome to JJDL Week 5 against my opponent, Slikippy and the Steel City Search. So, um, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment below, and subscribe for more Pokemon Draft League content. As you see, our team is on the left, and my opponent's team is on the right. There will be a timestamp right now for you guys to skip if you wish, but if you want to keep watching Team Builder, go ahead. So, our team. So, before I start a team builder, my opponent's team looks familiar, doesn't it? Well, that's because Oboe, our week one of our. That's because. That's because Oboe, our week one opponent, traded with them, and so now Skippy has Gouging Fire, Venusaur, and Torkoal, which is annoying for our team. So, that's fun. We have to fight Gouging Fire, Torkoal, Venusaur again. It was fun to fight it the first time. We got to fight again. So, our team is on, is on the left, and it consists of Great Tusk, Thunder Asterion, Ogre Pond, Har Wellspring, Iron Crown, Cinderace, Grimmsnarl, Quillfish, Gudra, Houndstone, and Munchlax with Terra's Thundee and Munchlux, and my opponent's team is on the right, and it consists of Gouging Fire, Heatran, Landorus, Samurott, Azelf, Torkoal, Venusaur, Hatterene, Arbolova, Terra's in Azelf, and ha Arbolova. So, the Terra's I think my opponent brings is, I think Azelf could be a Terra that beats my crown, so either ground ghost or fire could be something or dark could be something that comes here i think ghost or or just fire makes make the most sense and arbolova i could see um flying or bug for the tusk so yeah um let's see um so let's start the team builder starting with our gouging fire shock our round one pick in great tusk um so Great Tusk, um, Great Tusk does Great Tusk things. So, our EVs wise, we are 244 HP, max defense, 12 speed def, with the leftovers item, ambition nature, with the pros and disability, earthquake, knockoff, rabbit spin, body press. This mon is our gouging fire check. EQ can do a lot of damage to the gouging fire. And it avoids um, burning bulwark, which is which is great. Uh, we are body press for the Hisuian Samurott, rabbit spin for removal because there is no um, ghost type, and we can remove hazards that will harm. We can re remove stealth rocks from that can the Lando or Torque or, or Heatran can set or Hisuian Samurott spikes. And we can, um, that harm Cinderace and Thundee. We can remove them. And then, uh, knock off is knock off any items I do not want to deal with. Like any choice scarves or any leftovers, etc. Uh, defensive toss. This is our main gouging check. I think it can, it can check gouging and it forces a lot of pressure on my, on my opponent's team. So, that's a great task. Our next one we decided to bring is... The, the one of the heats of the week this week on our team, and that is Normal Gem Cinderace with Swords Dance, Pyro Ball, Low Kick, and Double Edge. The Normal Gem item. We are 32 HP, Max Attack, 224 Speed Jolly with the Libero ability. Um, so, uh, Cinderace, um, at plus two, we, we KO Heatran. At plus two, Pyro Ball does a lot of damage to everything. But the main thing is that plus two, normal gem, double edge, does tons of damage to the Torkoal. And I can chip down the Torkoal, which is very good for my team, because Torkoal is a problem. I want to remove the sun, so Gouging Fire and Venusaur cannot be a problem, which is good. If I can remove the sun, we're in a good position. Low Kick, KO Samurai plus two, KO Heatran plus two, Power Ball hits everything else for, else for good damage. I can freely SD on the, on the Arbolova, or the uh, Venusaur, if it's at, if I'm at 100% HP, because I I can live a 
earth power if I'm not a uh, fire type. If I'm normal, I can live. So yeah, um, that's Cinderace. Uh, and we outspeed the Azelf, and um, yeah, that's Cinderace. Um, I'm hoping that I could do very well this uh, week. Our next mon that we decided to go with is our Thunder Asterion, our other heat this week with Citrus Berry, 88 HP, 228 attack, 4 defense, 188 speed adamant with the Volt Absorb ability. Um, we, our moveset is Bulk Up, Agility, Acrobatics, and Terra Blast. So, um, the only, uh, flying resist is Heatran, which gets bought by Terra Blast. And, um, this set does very well because gouging Heatran get bopped by Terra Blast, Venusaur Acrobatics, Arbolova Acrobatics. Like if I can get this thing plus two plus two with um agilities and bulk ups, we can just sweep the entire team, which is very good for me. Citrus Berry. So I gain some HP and I have no item, meaning Acrobatics is a, is a 110 base power move, which is very good for our team. And yeah, that's Dundee. After we get up one agility and one bulk up or two bulk ups, we can we can win the game. So yeah, that that's Dundee's goal this this week. Our next one that we are bringing it helps Dundee in Grim Snarl with 240 HP, 1248 defense, 212 speed, death with careful nature, prankster ability, likely item with the standard set, dual screen P shot T wave. T-Wave helps versus the Gouging Fire. Um, Parting Shot's good to pivot out versus like the Landorus and the Venusaur. And um, Dual Screens are really good because if I can get those active, Cinderace can abuse them, Thunder can abuse them, and yeah, we're in a very good position. I, I will say this now, we are not bringing Ogre Pond, which is very, very um, heartbreaking, but um, uh, I just could not, I just do not see a good matchup for it. I don't want to get beat because, like, I, I don't want to do Rain Dance Ogre again because that was tech and they may have watched a video where Rain Dance Ogre Pond did work and they may prep for it, so that's not good. Um, but like, the, the our Bolivar does wall the uh, Ogre Pond and Venusaur pretty much does. I could run Zen, but it wouldn't do anything, so yeah, um, it wouldn't do much, but yeah, um, that's why we're not bringing Ogre Pond. So yeah, unfortunate for that, but um, yeah, um, Ripsnarl is a standard, we just, we team with the Venusaur and put in range of an outspeed mine, which lets me outspeed everyone else on the team, which is, which lets, uh, Venusaur be slower than my other mods in Thundee, Cinderace, and Posmatosk, on uh, outside of Sun. So, this is Grimstone, he, he does very well this game, and our next mod that we are bringing this week is none other than our Booster Speed Iron Crown with 172 Special Attack, 84 HP Max Speed. Um, we are um, Quark Drive Ability, um, Booster Energy Speed, Calm Mind, Focus Plus, Psychic, and Tachyon. Um, so Psychic hits Torkoal for good damage, Tachyon hits a lot of my opponent's team for good damage, and Focus Plus is mainly there for the Hisuian Samurai and the Heatran to do good damage to those two. We Oko Hisuian Samurai, so if we see Hisuian Samurai lead, we lead this, and Oko with Focus Blast, and then we're in a good spot. Yeah, that's a uh, crown for us. We just have this thing, and the end game can be very nice, or, or just lead breaker can be very nice for it too. Our next one that we saw, so that's crown. Our next one that we decided to bring is none other than our uh, Gudra. This is our main spadaf truck to my opponent, most of my opponent's team. We have Earthquake, which I forgot to change the color of. We have Earthquake for the Heatran. We have Draco Meteor, because the Dragon Resist is Hatterene, which, if it comes, I can possibly go on Crown and be with Tachyons. Ice Beam for the Landorus. Flamethrower for the Venusaur and the Arbolova. And um, they're good. it gets boosted in Sun. So, yeah, that's Gudra. Um, we're max special defense, max HP and 8 defense. This is our main spadef chuck to mons like the Azov if it's not Psyshock. Landorus, main, 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 main Landorus and Venusaur. And our Bulba, that can be very nice. And Gooey's ability, because if Gouging Fire goes for Outrage on um, my Gudra, 
it will be my it will be if it has one dance up already it will be neutral speed meaning I can have my um Cinderace outspeed it or my iron crown speed it so yeah that's uh, our team for this week of the JJDL so once again our team is Great Tusk, Cinderace, Thunderstarian, Grimmsnarl, Iron Crown and Gudra that's going to be it for this team builder and I will see you guys in the battle hey guys dashing Septile here and we are going to be doing our JJDL week Five against Sithikippi, Sithikippi, and um. Okay, so there is a lot of threats here. Okay, so they are bug on the art Ar ball of them, which is good to know. Okay, what do I want to leave with? I do not know. Um. I think I'm gonna lead like I there is there's no samurai so I don't really need to lead my uh you anymore. So I think I'm gonna lead my Grim Snarl and possibly just throw up a parting shot. I believe that's a good play. Yes, I can just throw up a parting shot on anything on my opponent's team. So yeah, let's do that. Let's just Throw up, throw up a parting shot and see where, where we go from there. Just parting shot out into one of my mons. So Grimmsnarl is prankster, parting shot. No Samrot's great. Um, Okay, so let's see what my opponent decides to do. Okay, so you lead with who? Lana, that's the land first. That I am okay with that. I am pretty okay with that. I'm gonna parting shot into my Gudra. I'm going to parting shot into my Gudra. If you're CA, that's just a good bring. If you're killing me, that's a good bring. Um, Gudra, I take zero minus one. I'm just, I'm just gonna parting shot and see where we go. There's no defense, no competitive. There's no nothing like that. Parting shot into the Gudra makes sense. Okay, so um, I get off the uh, parting shot, which is good for me. So you're minus one now. And I go into my Gudra now. I go into my Gudra. No, no Hatterene's also great for me. Because I can just throw, drop Dracos. That's also very nice. I can drop Dracos. That's very nice too. Okay, so. Sludge Waves. That's doing because 329. Fourteen with Sludge Wave. That is not Life Orb. That is not Life Orb. I'm gonna go for a Draco Meteor here. Looks pretty free into my opponent's team. There, there's like no switching to Draco on this team. And if you go Heat Train, I have Earthquake for that. You're just gonna drop a Draco. See where that gets me. So let's see. What do you go into here? You might you might give me the Landorus. You might go into Venus. Okay, you swap. Into who? Who's coming in here? Who's taking a Draco? Vulcan. Is this Heatran? That's Heatran. Okay. I miss. That's pretty good, actually. Heatran is here. Okay. I'm going to go for an Earthquake now. Because I have Earthquake for this Mon. So, let's see what you decide to do. You go for Wisp and Miss. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Cause I get off a big amount of damage on you now. That's really unfortunate. That's rough. That's really unfortunate. Do I have my fire? My fire is Cinderace. I don't want to go Cinderace on this though. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm gonna actually gonna send Nurse Cushion to go for Wisp again. I can I know this is a risky play, but this Gudra can actually just win possibly end game, like low key. This man just does way too much work. So Okay, you swap into who? Arbolova? Arbolova, great! That's great for me, I feel. Yeah, cool. I'm just, uh, this is the freest SD. 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 Freest SD I got. Freest SD I got. This is a free SD. You never stay in. You never stay in. You never stay in. Show them the swords dance. Show them the swords dance. Okay. Tree swaps into who? Torkoal? Torkoal. If you are not Max Fizz Def, I have a chance to kill you. With my normal gem hit. Double edge. Double edge sword. Let's go. Normal gem double edge. We do a bunch of damage to this mon. A bunch of damage to this mon. We do so much damage with this thing. We do so much damage with this thing. We do so much damage with this mon. Double edge, normal gem, hiya! That's a lot of damage. Go for earthquake. I live this now, actually. Yeah, I live this now easily. And now I th I feel this is a free low kick. I could be wrong. It's 80 base power. It kills from this range. So normal, so no more normal gem, which is fine with me. I'm gonna low kick and see how much I'm doing. Cause with Terra Normal, I have that in the count some normal type, normal libero. Uh, 26 to 31. So I should kill from this range. I should kill from this range. I should kill this mon from here. This also this also catches you going and gouging fire here. I feel. Yeah. Okay, you swap into who? Heatran? Is Heatran coming in? Heatran, okay, cool. That I, I am okay with that. Heatran gone. Heatran is gone, let's go. That's great, Heatran is gone. Heatran dead. Very cool. Heatran dead. Very cool. Cinderace is doing work. Normal gem, double-edged Cinderace is doing work. Okay. So, if Venusaur comes in. If Venusaur does try to come in. I wanna say go Gudra. I wanna say go Gudra. I wanna say go Gudra. Because I wanna pivot out. I don't want this mon dot. Because this mon can still do waste, can do so much work still. If you go gouging, I double edge. If you go land, okay, Kermit. This is the frog, which is the Venusaur. Okay. I'm at 130. 42%. Okay, I would die to like a lot of things, so I'm gonna just go into my um uh Gudra here. I'm gonna go into my Gudra here because this monk can still be valuable in the in the back. Um so we're gonna go we're gonna go Gudra here. Why the bot that's a fair play, okay. That's gonna do a pretty good amount of damage. 346 no, uh, thingy. 346. And a 10% sun. That's not life orb. Okay, that's like a mid roll for timid. Okay. Now, um, I'm gonna once again just 
go for Draco. I do not see a switch on this team. I do not see a switch on this team. Because Heatran is dead, there is no switch in the Draco Meteor now, which is very good for me. So let's see what happens. If Venusaur takes his hit, it can take the hit. Okay, you swap. Is this the Torkoal, your second Torkoal? Our Bolova. Okay. Respectable. Respectable, respectable, respectable. That's Spadaf. Yeah, that is Spadaf on the Arbolva. That is Spadaf on Arbolva. Yeah, that's that's very Spadaf. Okay, that's that is Spadaf. Good to know. Is the sun still up? No. Okay. The problem is, what do I want to go into? I'm not going Cinderace. That's a joke. That's not a good play. Wait, hold on. Um, Arboliva. You are tear a bug this match, which is good to know. Okay, so a minus two. I'm not doing any damage. I need I need to swap. Um. Hmm. But the question is, into who? That's the question, into who? This is not a this is not a good play. Um Uh I'm gonna go Grim Snarl on parting shot, I think. Or or, or give up a screen on parting shot, that's a good play too. Let's see what happens. You tear a bug. Okay, you tear a bug. So our Bolva is now tear a bug. Which is good for me. Pretty good for me, I think. You are now a Terra Bug, which means you are with the Acro. You, none of the weaknesses really change. I almost went Cinderace. What did you? What did you go for? Earth Power, Alluring Voice. Okay, that's a good bring. Okay, now are you leftovers? You are not leftovers. Okay, I'm going to go for a Parting Shot here into my Cinderace. If you catch me, good play. Very good play. If you catch me, very good play. But I believe my Cinder Racing is Arbolova, not Specs. Add minus one. This thing's like not offensive at all, I don't think. So if it's a calm nature, which I think it might be. Only thing that does damage is um only thing that kills my Cinder Race from 130 is Earth Power. I'm gonna go Cinderace. Alluring Voice. Very good. Very good for me. Very good for me. Okay. That is very good for me. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Hmm. I think it's a good Neosmon. This is risky, but I think it's a Neosmon. I think it's a Neosmon. I think it's a I think it's a Neosmon. I think it's a Neosmon. Could be a risky play. I think it's a Neosmon. Never give me this Mon. I want I want to kill Gouging. I want to go Gouging if it comes in. Cause that's their, they should go Gouging if they can. They should go Gouging. Cool. That's Landorus. Okay, cool. Landorus comes in. There's a scarf. That's a good play. That's a good bring. But let's see. I'm going to go for a double edge. I'm going to go for a double edge. Double edge sword. I'm going to go for double edge. If you're Scarf, you're Scarf. And I get that information. You're Scarf. Good to know you're Scarf. Good, really good to know that you are in Detroit Scarf and the Landorus. Yeah, good to know. 
the red on the Landers is Troy Scarf. I'm gonna go into my uh, Thunderous now. Because you're, you're locked into uh, Earth Power. I'm gonna go for a Agility. I'm not gonna try outside, so I'm gonna go for a Agility. Now, I'm gonna go for a, a Agility. I'm gonna go for an Agility. You're locked into Earth Power, so you're stuck into Earth Power. Which is good for me, I think. Which is pretty good for me, I think. Can you swap into who? Who's coming in here? Tree, Arbolova. Okay. I am pretty okay with that. I'm not going to Terra at all. I'm gonna just go for acrobatics. Here. Just gonna go for, just gonna go for acrobatics here. Good damage. Sour procs, good damage for me. Okay, now what do you go for? A learning voice. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure. That's what I figured you're gonna be going for. Kinda wanna bulk up in case you go for strength sap. I'm going to go for another acro though. Gonna go for another acrobatics though. So I am plus two speed my thumbs, which is good to know. Okay. It's a good amount of damage. Alarm voice again, that's good for me. I get my citrus proc now. I'm going to go for acrobatics here. I think you may give me this because it's really low and it's not getting those things up on anything really. I want to assume a second Torque, that's my guess. Lassie, that's gouging. That's gouging. That's hacking. That's hacking. That's, that's gouging. That's when you enter into Terror Blast. That's very defensive. So I'm gonna go for it. But yeah. That yeah, that's how much it should have taken from the first hit. I'm gonna go for Terra Blast. Ground. And hope I can kill. And hope I can kill from here. I hope I can kill from here on my uh Fundy. I, ho I hope I can kill my Thunder from here. I can kill a Thundee, let's see what happens. Kill, 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 kill. Ah, rip. Let's not kill, but Heat Crash comes off. And I'm gone. Okay, that's unfortunate. Okay.
I'm going to go... Turn it still active. Turn it still active. Okay, I gotta go into my... I think I got a crown. Yeah, I, I got I gotta go crown, I think I gotta go crown, yeah I gotta go crown. I I'm gonna obviously go for psychic. Here. Because I don't think you save this mine at all. I don't think you save this mon whatsoever. And if, hold on, um... With no life orb on your, uh, Venusaur... My Iron Crown in Sun does live a hit. Okay, so, you give me gouging, which is good for me. You give me gouging, which is good for me. And the grass is gone. That's another plus side. The grass is gone. And on um, the Landorus, it's not sure if it's just Choice Scarf. It's just one shot me still. Has a big chance just one shot me still, which is not good at all. Not good at all. Whatsoever. That's not good whatsoever at all. Okay. Um, so what do you go for? What would you go for here? I would assume Lando. I would assume Lando, maybe. But Gudra honestly walls the rest of the team. Low-key. Gudra walls the rest of the team. Looking at this. Gudra walls the rest of the team. Basically. Okay. Here's another nod. It's Scarf. I know it's Scarf. It's special, not physical, so... You can go Gudra, but you may you, you, you may U-turn. I'm gonna stay in low King just gonna go for Psychic. I'm gonna call you going for U-turn. I'm just... I'm just... Faster. You're just, you're just Modest Scarf, I think. That's, uh... Okay. I'm gonna go into my Gudra now and go for an Ice Beam. I'm gonna go for an Ice Beam here. Ice Beam. Ice Beam comes off now. Are both of us way too weak to even... Okay, so Earth Power comes off. I should always live this. Yeah, I do, okay. Ice Beam comes off and this guy should be down. Yeah, Len Lenard's gone cool. Very cool, Lenard's gone, gone very cool. Now the question is the Torkoal. Torkoal. In Sun. Flame Door does a good chunk. Earthquake. And on non grass terrain, no. Um. Hmm. You obviously do still have your Venusaur. You most likely go Torkoal. And honestly, my best click on uh, Torque was Flamethrower, I believe, on my Gudra. Um. But I think, like, eventually, this is this is just gonna be rough because. Franklin's Torque, okay, it's Torque. That looks to be Ranger Flamethrower. That looks to be Ranger Flamethrower from here in Sun, yeah, that's Ranger Flamethrower. That's 100% Ranger Flamethrower. I'm going to use Flamethrower. It looks like a range to me. And it is range. Cool. Guda gets another kill. Venusaur. And Sun. Flamethrower is doing way too much. And you are not a life orb on your Venusaur. So you're taking so much damage from this. And Arbolova should not live this. This might be a Gudra win. In the end, this might Gudra might win. Yeah, I think Gudra does just win. Kermit is the Venusaur. Gonna flamethrower. You 
growth. Okay, I should be fine. I should still be fine. I should still be fine. That's the weakest part. I should have said that. Okay. I was scared of my life right there. I was scared of my life right there. Okay. I'm gonna flamethrower again. I should- I- I live this. Cool. I think we're doing this game. I think we're doing this game. I think we're doing this game. Our Bolova is, like, very low. And I also beat it, because I'm base 80. It's base 39. I know I'm sassy, but I should still speed. And this should be game for Gudra. Our Bolova, I know it's like Spadef, calm, but it's on it. Yeah, this is definitely a range of flamethrower. It's Terra Bug too, so this should be game. Don't be like, okay, there, cool, GG's. Uh, that's game. Yeah, Guter, Guter just just walls the rest of the team. Wow, that was that was a scary game. That was a scary game. But yeah, GG's to my opponent, um, the Kippy and the Steel City Surge. Oh my goodness, that was a very scary game. The Arbolova is gone. The, uh, Torko and Venusaur are gone. Holy, Gudra is a goat. That, Gudra's getting thumbnail right now, but oh my gosh. That's a very good, uh, game. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Did you see my opponent, Sithikippi, and the Steel City Surge? And yeah, that's gonna be it for this bat, this video video and battle and i will see you guys next time peace out my subtitle squad and to everyone else that's watching thank you